Gail Porter, 51, opened up about the tough times in her roller coaster life and discussed how she was able to come out the other side. The mother of one is also sharing her advice for people who may also be struggling as she fronts a new Samaritans campaign. Recalling one of her worst times before the birth of her daughter, Honey, Gail told Express. Co.uk, many years ago, I was in not a great place. I mean, I've been up and down, I've had a wee roller coaster of a life but there was a time before I had honey that I didn't know who to talk to. Someone had mentioned the Samaritans and I thought, oh I don't want to waste their time, but I just wanted to cry so much. Eventually I picked up the phone and I was so pleased I did. Someone just answered, didn't ask my name, didn't ask me any personal details and I knew I had someone to talk to without getting judged. Gail's life hit another low point when she became homeless and forced to sleep on a park bench after work dried up following her alopecia diagnosis. She said, when I was homeless it got kind of tricky because I was embarrassed. It was only about seven years ago and I thought, how did this happen? I did eventually speak to a friend and it really helped me realize I could get through it. I know that my friends are there for me, I'm very fortunate. Addressing other people who may be going through tough times, Gail urges them not to feel like you are going to burden people. She continued, your friends are there and we need to talk to each other. My friends were really angry with me, not angry angry, but angry at the fact that I didn't want to talk when I was really having a bad time. As she aims to help more people, Gail with be at the No Filter Cafe in Manchester Piccadilly Station today, Tuesday February 21st, as part of Samaritan's Small Talk, Saves Lives campaign. The campaign empowers people to trust their instincts and start a conversation if they think someone needs help. At the No Filter Cafe, real users will pay for their morning coffee using Small Talk. Gail said, I'll be there so you can come and chat to me and I'll give you a coffee, but you have to chat to me first. We are encouraging people to talk. As for her projects coming up, Gail will be doing stand-up comedy at the Edinburgh Festival later this year. She excitedly said, I've always wanted to do it and then I thought, if I don't do it now, I'll never do it. I think I am going to make it a bit like a talk about lots of stuff that has happened to me which is quite dark but then putting the humor in it as well that you can laugh at and then think, should I be laughing at this? I'll say, remember when I was sectioned? And they all go, oh god. As for whether she minds discussing the darker times in her life, Gail says, now, not at all. I've got nothing to lose and if it helps somebody else. You know, people don't have to listen to me but if I say something that resonates with someone then you've done something good. It's like with the hair thing, a lot of people say to me, why don't you wear a wig? Well, it's really uncomfortable and I'm quite okay with being bald now. People will come up to me in the street and say, my mom's going through chemo, or my brother has lost his hair. People just chat, and I like that. You can find out more about Samaritan's Small Talk, Saves Lives campaign here.